Good afternoon. We're back here for an afternoon tour with our man Arthur. Okay, so here we go on the afternoon tour with our man Arthur back on the tour. This time we're going to this time we're going to uh, see some graffiti and a lot of art in another section of the old city. And hey, Arthur, how do you pronounce this section of the city? Oh, uh, right now we're going to have the Hexamani graffiti Hex art. Hexamani. Hexamani, sir. Yes. Hexamani. Hexamani. Yes, Thank you. Guys, can you tell us your uh, YouTube channel? Absolutely. Absolutely. So we can tag you? Yes. If you to Hexamani, listen to this. This corner is the monastery of the Franciscanos de Assis. To Cartagena we're arriving. The Franciscanos de Assis, the Jesuits, the Dominics, and the Augustinians. This corner belongs to the Franciscanos de Assis. The church is still on surface, and it is called the Church of the Third Order. The next thing is uh, the Franciscanos Monastery, but nowadays is the University of Rafael Núñez. Rafael Núñez University. Listen to this. In Cartagena, we used to have four movie theaters. Calamari, Cartagena, Bucanero, and the Black Venice, the Colón Theater. Nowadays, they are building a new super hotel. But look at my hand. These four movie theater, the backside of the Franciscanos Monastery, the backside of this building, the backside of this building, from this corner to the other corner, it's going to be a new super hotel for here, my friend, for 1,000 people. Let's continue. Center Commercial Hexamani Shopping Mall. Let's continue. Wow, we're really heading into the old city now. I mean, this is unrestored stuff, it looks like to me. Okay, we're starting to get into the wall art part of this city. Amazing, my friend, so full of people. And unfortunately, with the pandemic time, well, we are reactivating again and again. And we have a lot of hostels and little motels around here, I can see. Everybody feel like home. It's very nice. You see, excellent. Okay, we start to see here the first graffitis. Because some people said, oh, look at the wall. Oh, it doesn't look so nice. Hey. Let's try to paint it and let's try to put some colors. And they started to make the graffitis in Hexamani. ¿Por qué pasaron los graffitis en Hexamani a todo? Porque las paredes, las paredes estaban muy dañadas. Si alguna persona dijeron, especialmente los estudiantes, vamos a pintarla y a ponerle el color. Please, follow me this way. My friend, this is the place where the top models, when they come to Cartagena, they take pictures. Okay? When the top models come to Cartagena, they take pictures like this, like this. And then when we read the magazine, oh, 
this is the place where I do my tours every day. She's called La Mulata, and this is in memory of the Afro Cartageneras. In Chupac is Gabriel Garcia Marquez, the Nobel Prize of Colombia, the best writer. His number one book is A Hundred Years of Solitude. In Cartagena, they filmed two movies. One is called Love in Cobra Time, and the other one is called The Love and the Other Devils. El gran escritor de Colombia, Gabriel García Márquez, y su obra cumbre, Cien Años de Soledad. En Cartagena se firmaron dos de sus... Just beautiful. You like nice places to eat? They got nice places to eat. Open air bars? Yes. Restaurants? And look at this child. You know what is the meaning of this? The Arthur, meaning, what is the meaning of this? Yeah, the graffiers say, uh, I want to paint a nice kid with this aurora in the backside to show everybody that we must protect the innocence of the children. Because a child must be a child. And we must protect that part of the life with the children. This is graffitero. About the fall police in Cartagena de Indias and the Afro Cartageneras. Welcome to San Juan Evangelista Street. Let's go. Vamos, amigos, sigamos. Famous Artist Street. Yes, it is. Okay. Remember, in Cartagena we celebrate November's party for November 4th to November 11th. But in Hexamani neighborhood, the women. They also organize a special carnaval that is called Carnavalito from Hexamani. And this is the way they dress and they make up. De esta forma, las Hexamanicenses, los Hexamanicenses, preparan en Cartagena un carnavalito que se hace en las fiestas novembrinas. Se dice que esta es la forma en que ellas hacen sus vestidos y se maquillan para darle un toque especial al carnavalito de Hexamani. Vemos aquí todas las pinturas que tienen que ver con las hermosas casas eh, del barrio de Xamarín. Algunas pinturas súper especiales y la mayoría en memoria de las afrocartageneras. So you can see most of the pictures are for the afrocartageneras and the beautiful Xamarín houses. Let's take a look. Miremos un poco y seguimos, por favor. Amigo! No! Okay, señoras y señores, seguimos. Let's continue. House of Art. La segunda casa de arte. The second house of art. So you can see, and you can compare which one is the best. Watch your steps, be careful, or without it. I don't like yeah. So big. No? Oh, I like competition. You know why? Then it's gonna, you can offer cheaper. <laughs> you can bargain. That's the Colombian style. Everything is hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything is because of that. How do you like those flowers up there? Trellis across the street. I think it's a courtyard. I don't know why. We have this thing. Well, right. <laughs> 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 
Unfortunately, there's a lot of cars in the way of this beautiful artwork. Oh, nice. Hola. Buenas tardes. Just beautiful. Again. Look at the trellised vines going over the street with these beautiful flowers. Show me an African riddle that is <laughs> that is in our culture, and this guy is called Miss Black, the one you see there, and he had a nice son that is called Serrucho. What is the meaning of Serrucho? When you sow something. So tonight I'm going to show you to show you something like this. Yes, yes, yes. That's the meaning. I know it sounds funny, but it's the truth. I hope you like it. El Serrucho. Take a look. Okay, let's just be backed out of that. We tagged that. And time to go and catch up. Just absolutely stunning with all this artwork. Yes. Amigo, ¿cuánto creen ustedes que vale esta casa? How much do you think costs this house? Let's speak about real estate in Cartagena. In Colombian or U.S.? U.S. money. Only to guess how much. The whole Half house? a million. This one here. Maybe inside for six or eight bedrooms, no more than that. Yes. You know what they told me? 700,000 U.S. dollars. 700,000. Arthur has a little surprise to show us yes, I show that you. a lot of you Americans probably know who this might be. Right, o right over here. Yes, it's up in the right side, my friend. Can you imagine this? I want to see. We what know who it is, so we're not going to spoil it. <laughs> yes, Marilyn Monroe, como una palenquera, like a palenquera. <laughs> Excellent. I'm so sorry we can never came to Cartagena de Indias. But now we have her for everything. I can't take that. Marilyn Monroe in Cartagena. It's blocked off. Yes. Now we have an artist. We have an artist at work. Yes. They are painting Muy bien. La Buleca. Arthur, what is the meaning of La Buleca? La Buleca is like a hippie girl. Someone no stress, relax, young girl. You see? La Buleca. Arthur, why do you tell him he's a girl? We know he's a guy. No, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the lady just painted. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I need to get this picture. Oh, you were retorque a la buleca, la hacía falta de nada. Buena esa. Ya sabes lo que es la buleca, la metalina de Colombia. There's another little side.
Oh, the breeze is really nice. How do you like this vine? Red flowers, yellow flowers. Very nice, very, very nice. I might just run in there and get a juice. We'll see. Jeannie will probably be really mad at me, saying, I bought you something and you went in there and got a juice. All right, meanwhile, meanwhile, let's go see what this guy's selling. Oh, empanadas. Empanadas. These? Papa Reyes. Papa Reyes. And these? Falafel. Falafel. I like falafel. Okay. My man. The charcoal they're burning that's getting ready. What are they going to cook? Oh, all right. Okay, for everybody, we are right now located. Uh, at La Trinita Park. They are preparing everything because in one hour they will start to sell hot dogs, hamburger, pichos, arepas, empanadas, street food. So it's a nice place to enjoy excellent cheap street food tour. I'm not having a hamburger again today. The hamburger is excellent. <laughs> Amigo, let's go please. Let me show you something. We'll do it tomorrow or something. Look at this, these flowers. Okay, this is a place when I take the ladies to take a beautiful picture with this colonial house full of colors and flowers. This is the hummingbird. Please, yes. Okay, your, your cell phone, please. Officially, it's for the women, for the flowers. Okay. Yes, beautiful. Oh, this looks good. This has got my name written all over it. Oh, yes. We're going to have a great hamburger in one hour. Well, some people are taking the rest. <laughs> Siesta. Siesta, yes. Oh, she was sitting, okay? Who's Ferguson? Okay, come on here. Sure, come, on. come on, let's say hello to John and Jenny, okay? They're coming from USA. It's good to say hello to people all around the world. You say hello to Ireland. You say hello to India. You say hello to United States. You say hello to Colombia. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, she's a female. Es una chica, eh? Es una chica. She's a female. And she likes visitors. Uh, Alguien quiere una foto con ella? Do you want a picture with her? You? Okay, you can do it. Okay. Eh, muy pendiente. No tienes arete, verdad? Ni, ni cadenas. Eh, arete. Okay. No, pero son pegaditos. Okay. Porque está quitando de los arete. She, she, she likes the uh, necklace and the earrings. Okay. Uh, 
this is just like a hidden gem. I mean, this, this part of town is just awesome. Love it. Love, love, love. Yashimira. I never miss any little detail. <laughs> the local liquor store? <laughs> wow, just staying here? You know, Jeannie's right. This wouldn't be the worst place to stay. I mean, look at this. This is just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Who would have known until now? Well, I kind of did. Yeah, people like to usually they play the music loud. You see the green beers, yep. they domino chairs, everything. Yes. With the partner, with the good friends. Very nice, very nice. Native Cartageneros. Okay. How's that look? This is the famous Umbrella Street. When I was a child, my grandparents' uh, chairs were like this, with those colors. Yes, they, they still have the tradition. Okay, uh, camera please. Very nice, amigo. That's the place here for your Okay, please, in front of me. I'm going to take a picture with the beautiful umbrellas. They are changing the reality. All right, let's continue on here, looking at this beautiful umbrella street. Let me give this guy a little tidbit. I think I got a little something something for him. Amigo. Amigo. That's a nice smile. Very nice smile. Just beautiful. I'm taking this opportunity to get ahead of the tour so that we can get street life and... Hola, everybody! Pintico, dos estados! Look at you, muy bonita! <laughs> very, very beautiful. What about you, amigo? What about you? <laughs> okay. Yes, beautiful. Hola. Hola. Hello. Hey. How are you? Yay. All right. <laughs> Y vamos a ver el otro lado de Cartagena Limpia. You want to enjoy the priest and you will see the other side of Cartagena Limpia. Be careful. Con cuidado. You know, this street is very colorful and it is called La Lomba Street. La Lomba? La Lomba, yes. La Lomba was... Uh, um, Arthur, why is it called La Lomba Street? <laughs> well, La Lomba is a funny name and it means a lot of colors and then that's what they did exactly here. And you can see, for example, uh, something here looks like a dragon or like a totem, something related with Africa. 
but when we are in the front, we can see this much better. Please follow me, I'll show you. Les voy a mostrar cómo se ve este cuadro desde el fondo, que es diferente en Sachita. Like a tiki dragon. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, you see what's going on here? Here she comes. It looks like somebody's opening the corner with the hand, you see? Right. And then people say it looks like a drama, you see? Desafortunadamente te la pinté. Da, si me la pinté. He said that he painted. Okay, amigos. Nos vamos a la muralla de Hexamani. We go to the walls of Hexamani. Oh, that breeze feels good. Yes. Yes. Okay. La se sienta. The ladies sit down, please. The ladies. La dama se sientan primero. Ladies sit down first. Vamos a tener aquí un pequeño discurso. We're gonna have a small speech. A small speech. So when we go to the corner, we will see the highest point of the city that is called La Popa Hill. On the top. 180 meters square, we have the best view to see completely Cartagena de Indias. This monastery belongs to the Augustinians. On the other side is St. Philip's Fortress, the biggest construction that the Spanish people were building in South America. The history said to Cartagena were arriving six pirates, number one and number two from France, Robert Ball and Martin Cote, the number three and number four from England. John Hawkins and Francis Drake, the number five from France, Jean Bernard de Jean, and the number six, Admiral Edward Burnham. Check this out. Still running. One day they did a carnaval like three years ago, and one lady dressed like a snake. Yes. To remember la sierpe story. La sierpe story. It's excellent to win, eh? Oh, it feels so good. I told you, you're gonna enjoy it. Beautiful. Your win. You're gonna feel much better now. Gigi is hot today in the afternoon. In the morning, it was much better for her. I'm always hot. Oh, okay. I'm a hot lady. Uh, okay. Who is on the All right. You want fruit? They got fruit. Mango! Okay, we're back up on top of the wall. And from here. Yes, we have a Arthur's going to tell us about an unbelievable view. Yes, it is. So now we are in the Hexamani Wars, and you can see all around here, Boca Grande neighborhood, the new touristy area, is exactly in the backside. The bridge is joining Hexamani to Manga Island. This is La Popa Hill. La Popa Hill is the highest point of the city, 180 meters square. On the top is the monastery of the Augustinians. This is a Philip fortress, the biggest construction that the Spanish people were building in South America. The pirates were arriving to Cartagena in 16 and 1700. Robert Ball and Martin Cote from France. John Hopkins and Francis Drake from England. Jean Bernard de Jean from France. And the number six, Admiral Edward Vernon from England. This is the biggest construction that the Spanish people were building in South America. Señora y señor, millones de pesos. Siete mil millones de pesos. Let's go see what Jeannie's doing. Go on, get up there! She stepped up there with 
no problem. Look like effortless. Right. Go on, get up there. I tried. Move. My shoulder hurts. <laughs> I'm going to dive in. Please don't jump. I like you very much. Please don't jump. I will not jump, Arthur. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I help you. I help you. No, no. I'll I give you a push. I can get up, buddy. I can get up there. I'm going to try. You don't have to push me. Okay. She's gonna come up here and then she's and then she's gonna back off. The second she gets here, she's gonna go like, I'm not doing any further than this. Oh, I can't do it. Push! Arthur, push! No, no. Pull! Ah, I told you. I have never been here. I wanna take a look. Wow. Come on, Jeannie, get to the get to the, okay, now get to the edge. Now you can have your romantic moment. Hold on, what's You'll die if you fall off that too. <laughs> Go a little further out. Check out that plane. It's got it's got bombs on it, I swear to God. It's like an old Spitfire or something. If this thing comes around again, I'll give you a good shot out a shot of it. Alright. I just want to take a picture of the port from here. Okay. Uh, Since we're going there tomorrow? Yeah. Okay. I'm down to like 23% um, battery. Got plenty of data, but look, no battery. Look at the birds. I see all those birds. Okay, here he comes. Check out the wings with the bombs that are hanging off of it. It's a John and Jean. In Hexamani in 1902, some people died heart attack because it was too hot. They said the wind is not arriving to the neighborhood. You know what they decide? From this corner to the next corner, one kilometer, they destroy the wars. So now we see the bay, we don't see the wars. This big was there, now no more. 1902. Finish one kilometer of wall in Cartagena de Indias in Hexamanil. I'll show you the way. Se lo voy a mostrar porque ahí destruimos un kilómetro de muralla. Desde aquí hasta el centro de convenciones. Y se, di y se dice que era de este mismo tamaño. Yes. Let's go and take a look. El paraguas. Manga Island. Yes, sir, Manga Island. If I open this, it's going to be better for us to cross the street, yes. <laughs> yes. Excellent. Arthur. Excellent. All right. Excellent. Let's continue. Arthur. Yes, I'm here. You're like Mary Poppins. Yes. <laughs> See? Some people told me that in the past. Everything's Mary Poppins with you. Hey, well, I was feeding the birds yesterday. Yes. <laughs> Poppins a bag, and now he's Barry Poppins today. Arthur's bringing us to see the sunset, and as you can see, it's getting close. Okay, be careful, con cuidado. Colombian trap. Colombian trap, con cuidado los huecos. Okay. Let's stop a moment. So you can see the world was here. Oh, yeah. Until the end, we destroyed one kilometer of wall on this area. So now we see the bay, and the wind is always arriving to Examani. On the other side, you can see the military area. In Colombia, the warship and the submarines are from Germany. The aircraft in Colombia is from USA and Israel. Señoras y señores, de aquel lado quedan las fuerzas militares. En Colombia, los barcos de guerra y los submarinos son de tecnología alemana. Y los aviones de guerra son de Estados Unidos y 
The best German beer, the Lion of Fire. Okay? Colombian trap. The Lion of Fire. Are you gonna put that in the video? <laughs> they must be careful, that's all. From now on on your tours, you're gonna say, be careful, Colombian trap. <laughs> I know you're gonna say that. Okay, be careful, Colombian trap. Right. <laughs> and then you're gonna say, F you money for number six. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> the Rosario, uh, it's not Rosario. Oh, wait, wait. It's not Rosario. It's not Rosario. Rosario. Rosario is another one. Rosario. And what, uh, if you uh, recommend wing heat work? Okay, I think we might be coming towards the end of the tour. Uh, we're getting to, to this park and we're going to go check out the sunset. Man, these people know where to watch the sunset. Okay. Listen. Uh, this area, from the convention center to the end, that is exactly this area, the wall was here. The wall was here. And we destroyed one kilometer of wall. You know why? Because, the breeze. because in 1902, some people died here of heart attack, and they said it's money is too hot. Then they make a meeting, and they decide to destroy the walls that the wind can arrive to Hexamani. Exactly this area, one kilometer until the convention center. Got this it. area have no walls, and now we can have an excellent sunset in this area. Beautiful. Yes, it is. Okay, amigos, vamos a tomar una foto despedida. I want to go buy pictures. Oh, that's a lot of please. Let me, let me buy here. Una foto a este lado. And then I, y después le digo adiós. Okay, please.